Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and I'm coming at Liza P with a fresh new attitude because Fuoco the King's Flame is finally down. I don't know where all of my mistakes were necessarily coming from, but I do know that that second phase is something to be reckoned with. Oh, let's turn that back on. That was obviously the key to my success. So here we are in the boss arena. I have a feeling that uh, this body right here. Yeah, we're going to have to report this back to Lorenzini, aren't we? What do we have here? A broken butler puppet. Now, I seem to remember someone on the second floor. Think it belongs to him? We got to ask what happened sometime. Now's good. Okay, that seemed a little dark. Now, we also got a whole bunch of loot from Killing Fuoco. Starting with... We got the high powered flame amplifier. So this is a Legion arm core part. So this is an enhancement material. This is an exchange material. The central core of the King's flame Fuoco. Legion arm that expels immense firepower can be crafted with the Vanini craft machine. The puppet dreamed of a fire that would make the King's army. At the end of a desperate fight with a boy puppet, that was me. The fanatics burning fire was scattered into foolish ash. Also, do we get a special Ergo, we did the King's Flame. To Fuoco, the ordinary puppet, protecting the factory's fire was a sacred duty. As soon as he learned of the King of Puppets, he bowed down to a new god. What else did we get? We also got the Flame Grindstone. Oh my. Okay, temporarily imbues weapon with fire. A special grindstone that can be equipped to a grinder. It can be triggered by using the grinder when guarding. Because it is fragile, it cannot be used often. Special grindstones were made to respond quickly in battle. These grindstones made from artificial gems sharpen weapons and temporarily imbue them with special abilities. That's very, very cool. Very, very cool indeed. Okay, that's the booster glaive. It looks like that's those are the three items that we got. So we're going to be heading back to Lorenzini soon. However, what's... What's beyond? Mm, okay, never mind. We're going to be going now. Because I don't know what else is down there. Maybe this will convince him to return. I don't know. But we can actually just teleport, which is really nice. So teleport to the control room. Let him know what, uh, what happened to his poor butler friend. And see if he's going to head back to the hotel. Otherwise, maybe we have more uh, more of a quest ahead of us. Thank you. Ah, you're back. And you found... Oh, dear. Pulcinella. They really did a number on you. Pulcinella was proof that puppets possess true courage. I will not rest until I have revived him. But there will be ample time for that. First, I must thank you for a truly heroic piece of work. The factory is ours again. The puppets are going to be in really bad shape after this. Let us return to the hotel and rest while we can. Okay, are you just going to head back? I cannot shake the thought of that puppet army. What they meant to do. The cathedral is filled with refugees. People who thought they were safe. But as for the future to solve, maintenance must come first. See you at Hotel Krat. Arrivederci. Alright, we have some uh, history buffs in the chat. This little doodad on his wrist, what? What is that? It almost... Is that like a portable typing machine? So he could just take notes on the go? That's pretty cool, if so. Alright, so that's all he's got. I'm going to go back. I'm going to push forward beyond that Stargazer just to see if it continues. I don't know if it does or not. That might be the way to the Cathedral. But we'll go back to the hotel soon. I need to find out how I can enhance my Legion Arm. Also create a new one. Uh, and we also need to figure out about this Grindstone. Yeah, that's not doing anything. Okay, I must have to insert that into the grindstone somehow. 
I love the sliding down mechanic. Also, I mentioned this before, this is one of the few ladder slides that sort of makes sense. It's not exactly perfect because it still has the actual rungs are definitely sticking out ever so slightly. But normally when we slide down ladders, it just makes no sense whatsoever that you'd be able to even do that. This looks like an explosive barrel. <laughs> Had to test it, right? You were curious. A fire canister. So this is just... Is this going to be like the electric blitz one where I dump it on the ground? Yeah, it creates a... Okay, it just creates a pool of fire where it lands. It can be thrown, but it's at close range. Okay. So we're heading back outside. Yeah, this might be the way to the cathedral. So if this ends up going really far, we might just backtrack. Whoa. Okay, that's some damage. He had a fury attack coming up. I was hoping for the rear fatal. So I have to go through this mine shaft, huh? In order to get to the cathedral, most likely. Oh. Yeah, someone's gonna try and catch me. I figured as much. I do like the dashing R1. Quite a bit. Quite a bit indeed. Alright, what do we got here? Iron protection. Resistance ampule. I hope I'm not missing out on anything important by going to the hotel. I kind of thought this might be a really short trip. I don't think that's the case anymore. Oh, you can actually target those. That's really fun. I do like that. Okay, let's... uh run past you okay let's go let's go up I don't know why but that's what I'm choosing oh glad I did oh whoa no 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 all right well it's a few thousand ergo but it's also a quick trip back to a Stargazer. So even though you're all going to be yelling at me, I'm going to leave it there and I'm going to go back to the hotel. Just because obviously that's a, a much further trip than what I had imagined. Boy, they are, they are hitting very hard. And did just show Lorenzini there. Okay, they do take both electric or more electric and physical damage when they have been electric shot. I thought that was the case, but I just wanted to be doubly sure. Okay, let's do the usual rounds. First off, piano. That still has not changed. have no idea thanks for keeping me okay nothing new from miss antonia let's go to polandina welcome to hotel nothing new from you nothing new to buy uh oh it isn't my savior whoa Glad to see you made it back in one piece my friend Loads of stuff there. Uh, in a moment. I don't know why, but I want to talk to you, Jenny, first. I know my way around. 
but she has nothing to say. All right. Valencia? Buongiorno, and welcome to the Pucinella. house of Vanini. I am Master Vanini's Major Domo. Pucinella, at your service, sir. The house of Vanini carries only the finest in luxury merchandise. I believe you'll find all items to be both superior quality and distinguished provenance. I am certain you will be able to find something that suits you, sir. At the house of Anini, even priceless things have a price. Every item is a treasure of distinguished quality and superior provenance. Oh, and you're a merchant. You only sell one of each of these, however. We have a motivity crank, technique, advance, and balance. The electric blitz grindstone. Oh, wow. Okay. I definitely want that. Reinforce liner. Very good. Okay, so slash piercing and strike attacks. Very good. We'll uh, we'll purchase that before we go. Look at all this stuff. There you are, my boy. My savior. Yes, that's the word. You took back the factory and I cannot thank you enough. Without the factory, no more new puppets. The army has run out of recruits. My friend, you saved, well, all of us. Ah, but listen to me going on and on about my concerns and I don't believe I've even introduced myself. Signor Lorenzini Venigni, gentlemen, bon vivant and at the moment, utterly at your service, my friend. If the name Venigni rings no bells, perhaps you've heard of Kratz, Prince of High Society. That is because they are one and the same. Just two of the many names I've collected in my three decades here on Earth. While I sincerely believe meeting Venigni is its own reward, I have not rewarded you in the more uh, traditional manner. Please. Take this, my newest prototype. It'll be safe with you. It's a grinder stone that keeps granting special attributes to the grinder. I hope you'll put it to good use. Aha, grinder modification tool. You can equip a special grindstone on a grinder through Vanini or a Stargazer. There are different types of special grindstones that grant different effects to your weapons. You can use a special grindstone's effect in battle only once but it recharges if you revive or visit a stargazer. I'm okay with that. That is pretty amazing. Uh, then my eyes do not deceive me. I never imagined I'd actually see it again, and in the flesh, so to speak. I just designed it, set it aside, and never got back to it. Genius and the claim can keep one quite preoccupied, I'm afraid. You are really interested in the arm, I see. Then, my friend, you shall have it. It just needs a few mechanical adjustments to fit your um, particular needs. And frankly, this design is almost child's play to me now, so let's start by making it a bit stronger, shall we? I will also add what we brilliant inventors call modularity. That means it will be much easier to improve and repair since you'll be able to use commonly found parts. You might say this arm's new abilities are... Uh, legion! <laughs> no? Too much? It was too much. It seemed like something else was supposed to happen just now. I always welcome friends. Okay, switch grindstone of grinder. Ah, uh, okay. So right now we have the flame. We can buy the electric one from... Our good friend Pulcinella, which I probably will. I'll actually leave that alone. But let's talk about Pulcinella. Of course you're curious. Pulcinella has been restored thanks to you. In a small way. Mostly it was me, but uh, you know, genius never rests. Except for beauty rest. <laughs> Pulcinella isn't just my butler. He's my family. The only one I have left, really. I won't forget what you've done for us. If you ever need anything or find yourself in a spot of trouble, 
Call on your friend Venigni. We got swagger. All right. Do you think he wants to see that? That'd be kind of weird since he just gave it to me, but why not try it? One of the ironbound rules of the alleyways. Never strut around if you don't have a weapon on hand. <laughs> That's a terrible gesture. Look at he's typing! I always welcome. No one, not even I, know what started the puppet frenzy. Why? That day of all days. Ah, it was horrible. A violent rampage of murder and mayhem that is seared into my memory for all time. And it was never supposed to happen again. I made sure of it. Designed a few special parts to ensure they'd remain loyal. Puppet armies do not arise by chance. There was intent behind this. I don't want to leap to conclusions, but the only one I know with that kind of power is the King of Puppets himself. I... We need to learn how this happened. Alright, so that's all he has for now. I'm gonna bypass this. I'm curious about the train, and I'll tell you why in a moment. Let's see. Amatsa, that is one slick prototype. You think it's a tram for... Crickets? Oh, that's it? Amatsa, you think it's a... I thought maybe this was some sort of model of the train I came in on, and it would give me a clue as to that secret door, maybe, in the back behind the breakable wall. It's his humility that I appreciate. All right, what do we have here? Here we go. So now we can craft a Legion arm. Whoa, okay. Lamberge. Okay. Very, very nice. Legion arm full of burning flames. When its muzzle is opened, it burns the enemies before you. It can also become the wave of fire. Strength and combustion. And flame explosion. Deus Ex Machina. Legion arm that can install a motion sensing landmine. Okay. Pandemonium. Legion arm that fires a sticky acidic substance. Corrodes enemies to step into the wide pool of acid it creates. Aegis. Legion arm that can block enemy attacks with your left arm. When it receives a blow, the embedded device explodes and deals damage to the enemy. That's pretty cool. Falcon Eyes, fires armor-piercing shells from a distance. The launch shells explode soon after they land, and back to Flamberge. So we need Legion Plugs. We don't have any of those, but we do have the High-Powered Flame Amplifier. Go ahead and craft that. Oh, wait a minute. Go back to... Wait a sec. Why does this say sold out? You cannot purchase anymore. What? Okay, maybe I just need to now modify. 
Yes. Okay. So a Legion Caliber is what I need to get the next level of any of these. Odd that it tells you... Wait, what? It's weird that it gives you option to modify ones you don't actually have crafted yet, but let's see. So Puppet String, what is Trace? Press and hold the Legion Arm button to retract an enemy. How is that really different? I'm not to track an enemy. Can someone explain this to me? Pulls it towards you. This one is pulling me towards the target. But I'm not really sure what the difference is. Movable charge is pretty cool. I do like that. I do like Fulminus a lot. Wave of Fire could also be... In fact, you know what? Wave of Fire might be really good for the mines that we're going in because of all those explosive barrels. So let's let's do that. All right. And that's all she wrote here. Is there anything new outside? Any new training dummies? Nope. Okay. So we still now need to go find Sophia as well as Geppetto. Well, here's Sophia. I'll use my power to... I am able to wield Ergo. They call me a listener because I can hear Ergo. I inherited the power from my mother, who hated it, called it the devil's power. So I kept it a secret that I could talk to puppets. Now you are the only one my voice reaches. So I beg you, please, save Krat. Nothing else from her right now. Just to see if anything has changed, it's going to run the other way that I normally run. Okay, Geppetto, you probably have another quest for me. Let me guess, you're going to have me go to the cathedral next. Anything new glowing? He hasn't moved this whole time. Go see your friend. Dad. Remember, I didn't design every puppet in Krat. It is not surprising that some puppets broke away from the Grand Covenant. I've no idea how many. I remember a few ergo puppets behaving according to their own volition before the frenzy. That wasn't our intention. They were never designed to act that way. But if a puppet starts acting on its own, does that mean the puppet has free will? Or is someone else controlling the puppet? The city have asked me and You What? You Your friend is right downstairs. I I saved him. <laughs> Strange. Definitely feels like there should be more dialogue from Geppetto. Can I jump? No fall damage. Alright. Well, I guess... I guess we head back into the mines. Oh wait, switch grind, so no grinder. Oh right, we were going to... Let's see. We need a thousand... So let's do, we'll do all eight. Ooh, can I use multiple? Yes, good. Let's use all eight and then one of these. There we go. At the house of Anini. And we're gonna purchase the electric blitz grindstone. Thank you. And we are going to apply that. Yeah, electric blitz for sure. There we go. Does it look different? It does. Okay, you can kind of see the little gem. I love that. All right. So let's teleport. Just want to make sure there's nothing showing up. No symbols. Okay. Center Vanini works.
Oh, we want to switch our arm too from Fulminus to Flamberge. So we're going to switch Legion Arm from Fulminus to Flamberge. Very nice. That looks so cool. And are we happy with this weapon? Maybe not. Maybe we put on our... Oh, it's not assembled. Okay. Let's reassemble our shock coil. With... Not the baton handle. Fire axe handle? Yeah. That'll work. Yeah, I like that. I think that's perfect. Now, let's not die on the way, because I would like to reclaim that 7700 ergo. So it does stay on. That's good to know. Thank you for that. I will gladly take that. Now, what is... Okay, the handle is in door, I believe. That is my fable. All right, you're... There you are. You're just right behind it. Nope. Back up. Did I roll into it? Is that what I did? Yes, that's exactly what I did. Do your thing. Oh, ouch. Remember, we don't... Uh, we don't die yet. I wonder if I should just clear the bottom floors before we start climbing up. Or if that's more dangerous. Love that kill. Because perhaps the ones up above could be targeting us with throwables. So far, oh, see, yep, that's that's exactly what's going on here. Something's gonna come out of there, so don't. Yeah, I knew it. Back up, back up. Oh shoot. Heal. Give it go. Take it. Dark Moon Moonstone of the Covenant. D what? Dark Moon Moonstone of the Covenant. Oh, upgrade special weapon blade up to plus three. Extremely rare enhancement material that can be obtained in different parts of Krat for special weapons. The blind butterfly desperately sought a savior, clutching a moonstone. It was as if it wanted this world at least to survive. Only ever so slightly ominous there. What was happening with our uh, with our world there? Oh, shovel McGillicuddy again? All right. I already forget how to deal with you. That's not it. <laughs> All right, well, we're just about at the 30-minute mark, so I am going to call it apart there. Next time, we will make our way further into the mines, probably. But that's going to do it for this episode of Blue Plays Lies of P. Hope you're enjoying half as much as I am, because if so, then you're having a great time, because I am just immensely enjoying this game. So thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you next time.